Give Jesus a big hand, somebody. Do it like a minute. Glory be to his holy name. Take your Bibles and open in the book of Peter. Glory be to his holy name. We are preaching on this subject, God's medicine. How to receive divine healing and how to keep it. 2 Peter 1, 3. Listen. Are you there? Verse number 3. According as his divine power he hath given unto us all things that pertain unto life and to godliness through the knowledge of him that hath called us to glory and virtue. The word virtue there means power as well. But I want you to notice that it says according as his divine power hath the word he has is past tense. Given us, does it say few of the things? Some of the things? Two of the things? All things that pertain unto life and unto godliness. All things that pertain unto godliness and unto what? Unto life. In other words, there is nothing God is about to do. He has already done everything. He has already done the healing that he needs to do. The prosperity that he needs to do. No wonder when God created Adam, he looked all around to try to find where he was going to get this Eve. The Bible says he created the soil. <laughs> and after creating the soil, the Bible tells us that God looked around for a partner Amen. for Adam. Amen. And after looking around, the Bible says, could not find a helper suitable for him. But then he looked into Adam and realized everything I'll ever need is inside Adam. The money you need is inside you. The prosperity you need is inside you. The joy you want is inside you. The marriage you are looking for is inside you. It's not going to come from anywhere except inside. And the Bible says, he made Adam to sleep. And entered deep into Adam. Performed the spiritual surgery. And got Eve out of Adam. Why? He had already finished creation. Your prosperity is not coming from another man. Our duty as men of God is to expose what is inside you. This is why I say a prophet will never be angry with you. A prophet can never shout at you. Why? Every shouting that I do as a prophet is a prophetic word to you. You, you still not get my point. If I see you in my company messing up and I shout at you that you should have performed it this way, don't get angry. I'm seeing another level you have not tapped into. You're still not getting what I'm talking about. So when God created, he said, according as a divine nature, he's given us all things. In other words, the divine nature causes us to provide all things, not just to get all things. No, no, no. Do you see what the Bible says? It says, according as his divine power, that is nature, he has given, past tense. So a divine nature is able to supply. Verse number four. Whereby are given unto us exceeding and great promises that by these ye might be partakers of the divine nature. Aye. When the Bible says partakers of the divine nature, it's talking about participating in the divine characteristics of a divine God. Whatever God does, we do. I can see it's very, very slow. God's idea was to reproduce himself in his sons. If God is not sick, I should not be sick. If God is not broke, I should never be broke. Yeah. 
according to as his divine nature has given us all things now he says we are now partakers participators co-sharers not just sharers there is a big difference we are partaking of the same thing god 50 i'm on 50. that's why we are called sons of the most high galatians 3 16 quickly we want you to understand where we get healing it is important to notice where healing is coming from because the biggest problem of a christian is is god willing to heal me i know he heals i know he can heal somebody but what about me uh, uh. i'm hearing a lot of testimonies but what about me these are the biggest problems that christians face now to abraham and his seed where the promise is made he saith not to seeds but to seed as of one which is christ jesus the bible is saying we are not abraham's seeds it is one guy who is abraham's seed and the Bible says, he saith not and to seeds as of many, but as of one and to thy seed, which is Christ. Verse number 29. Now watch this. And if ye be Christ, then are ye Abraham's seed. I know. It's a very difficult thing, right? The Bible has already discounted that we are not Abraham's seed. It's only Jesus who is Abraham's seed. But then he changes and says, If ye are Christ, who is Abraham's seed, then ye also are Abraham's seeds and heirs to the promise. God's medicine. Discover how to receive divine healing and keep it. Order your copy from the Amazon Kindle Store or visit our online shop at www.hubertangel.org or call the number on the screen now. Hubert Angel Ministerial Association for mentorship, teaching, and impartation for those in ministry or those who have a calling. Register at www.uama.co. For the Good News Church, call the number on the screen for more information. Thank you, our partners and friends, for making it possible to bring this message to you. Those wishing to partner with Hubert Angel, please visit www.hubertangel.org. I don't know if you're here. Are you here? Are you here, somebody? Now, I now need to know what promises Abraham has so that I can tap into Abraham's seed. I can get into the promises of Abraham. I no longer need to wait for somebody to tell me whether God wants to heal me or God doesn't want to heal me. I now need to know, am I Abraham's seed? And the Bible says, yes. And then it says, yes, according to the promise. I can see, I can see, I can see. Ah, oh, somebody's gonna get healing today. I said you are going to get your healing today. You are going to get your healing today. What is the scripture saying? It's saying we are who? Abraham's what? 
Abraham's what? We are trying to simplify this thing so that when you get something, you say to yourself, okay, I am sick, but does God want to heal me? You see, faith begins where the will of God is known. If you don't know the will of God concerning healing, you will never have faith for it. If you don't know the will of God concerning prosperity, you resign from prosperity. Right now, there are some people who are sick, but they know their sister was healed. And they wonder, why is it happening for some people and not for me? You are still not getting it. And he was teaching on the Sabbath, yes. And behold, there was a woman which had a spirit of infirmity 18 years and was bowed together and could in no wise lift up herself. And when Jesus saw her, he called her to him and said unto her, Woman, thou art loosed from thy infirmity. Now, you can say, but that's for that woman. Fair in. He laid his hands on her, and immediately she was made straight and glorified God. 14. And the ruler of the synagogue, the pastors, the bishops, answered with indignation, because that Jesus had healed on the Sabbath day and said unto the people, There are six days in which men ought to work. In them therefore come and be healed, and not on the Sabbath day. 15. The Lord then answered him and said, Thou hypocrite, I wish I had the boldness of Jesus. I said, I wish I had the boldness of Jesus. Just looking at the bishop and said, You snake. I can think of five or six names. I just want to say snakes. Thou hypocrite, doth not each one of you on the Sabbath lose his ox or his ass for the store and lead away to watering? Let's go. And ought not this woman? not this woman being a daughter of Abraham and the Bible told us in Galatians 3 29 we we are Abraham's seed now Jesus is saying the only reason why you need to be healed is you are Abraham's seed the only qualification for today for you to be healed are you Abraham's seed are you Abraham's seed are you Abraham's seed and if you are Abraham's seed ought not Oh, you are not flowing with me. So, does God want to heal everybody? No. But does God want to heal Abraham's seed emphatically? Yes. Are we Abraham's seeds? Yes. Are we going to be healed? Yes. Why? Because we are holy? No. Because we don't sin? No. What is the reason? We are Abraham's seed. That's the main reason. That's the qualification. That's all there is to it. Give Jesus a big hand, somebody. God's medicine. Discover how to receive divine healing and keep it. Order your copy from the Amazon Kindle Store or visit our online shop at www.hubertangel.org or call the number on the screen now. Hubert Angel Ministerial Association For mentorship, teaching, and impartation for those in ministry or those who have a calling, Register at www.uama.co. For the Good News Church, call the number on the screen for more information. And in your love, I am 
thank you our partners and friends for making it possible to bring this message to you. Those wishing to partner with Hubert Angel, please visit www.hubertangel.org. Just as in the days of the apostles, where the sick were laid on the streets so that the apostles' shadow may overshadow them as they pass by, here, in a stadium filled with over 20,000 people, the man of God, with confidence in the power of God, called for people with blood pressure problems to come out of the crowd and have their blood pressure measured by an independent, on-site medical team. They were then instructed to pass through the shadow of the man of God without being told what would happen. They were then remeasured and instantly, by the power of God, the results began to normalize. Father, in the name of Jesus, as we're in this moment of miracles, may you touch every one of them. Yes. Heal them. Show them your mercy. In the name of Jesus. Listen, the faith you have used to come from your house to this stadium is faith enough to be healed. Yes. Faith enough for you to get your miracle. Yes. We don't have a faith problem in this stadium. Yes. By coming from where you came from, that's faith enough. I understand there are some Maybe you have a high blood pressure. I don't know where those machines are. The high blood pressure machines. We were. That side. Go to that pastor there. If you have high blood pressure and the doctors have said you have high, high blood pressure, I want you to go there. We measure you. After we measure you, you come here and I will decree something and you go back. They will measure you, the doctors and the nurses. And it will, be, it will have gone down. Now, Go and get measured. Just go in that corner there. Something is going to happen. All I hear is good news. All I hear is good news. In your presence. All I hear is good news. Only you are worthy. If you're ready, let me see you. Yes. Blood pressure is coming down. Yes. This gentleman uh -huh. had a high blood pressure. Uh -huh. What you say is get them tested. Yes. And they didn't, you didn't even touch them. You asked them to pass by your shadow. All they did was to pass by your shadow. His blood pressure was 180 over 127. When he passed by your shadow, he was tested for the second time. And it has gone down to 168 over 124. The same with this lady, Major Prophet. Yes. The blood pressure was high. But when she passed by your shadow. Yes. She was tested again. It was 182 over 114. When she passed by your shadow, she went back and was tested for the second time. And it has gone down to 181 over 105. Give Jesus a big hand, somebody! He keeps on doing great If a shadow can heal the sick, 
you are better than a shadow. I said you are better than a shadow. You are better than a shadow. The Bible says, Elisha died and they put him in a grave. And his bones, when they touched a dead body, the dead came back to life. You are better than the bones of Elisha. I said you are better than the bones of Elisha. You are a conduit of the anointing. Begin to receive it, begin to receive it. Blood pressure is coming down. It's continuing to come down. This man here. Yes. His blood pressure was at 145. Yes. Over 109. Uh -huh. But when he passed by your shadow. Yes. It has gone down to 141 over 88. It has Give really, Jesus really, really, really gone down. somebody. What are these ones doing? What are these ones for? Oh, they are being tested now. Come, 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 come. Quickly, let's do it. He keeps on doing great things. Hallelujah. Jesus keeps on. initially tested uh -huh. his blood pressure was at 134 over 111 uh -huh. but when he passed by your shadow yes you got tested for the second time yes his blood pressure is now at 136 over 91 so it has really 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 dropped are you ready blood pressure yes cannot stand against the voice of the prophet uh-huh you declared blood pressure is going down yes this man came all the way from Mauritius Yes, stand up. Just stand to up. receive his miracle. Look in at Mauritius, place. they're celebrating. Let's clap hands for those from Mauritius. We have come all the way for encounter. His blood pressure was at 146. Yes. Over 107. Uh -huh. But when he passed again by the shadow, he was tested for the second time. It's gone down to 142 over 93. And which is a very big drop. Give Jesus a big hey, hand, somebody. Hey. High blood pressure. Uh -huh. is indeed under high prophetic pressure this lady here she came her yes. blood pressure was at 159 over 101 but when she walked under the shadow of the prophet it dropped down after being tested for the second time to 140 over 98 give jesus a big hand somebody give jesus a big hand somebody papa yes there's a miracle. Yes. This man uh -huh. is all the way from Botswana. Yes. He left his wife bedridden. The wife was sick and the wife sent him to this encounter. She said, if only you can be in the presence of Prophet Angel, I know I'll be healed. She was watching when you declared good news. The wife called and said, I immediately felt power going inside of me i rose from the bed give jesus a big hand somebody yeah. Yeah. Changing. wherever you are give jesus a big hand there is no distance in prayer i said there is no distance in prophetic declaration if somebody in botswana can catch the wave of the anointing here you are very near you are very near you are very near i said you are very near god is doing something Blood pressures are going down. This atmosphere is so saturated with miracles. God's medicine. Discover how to receive divine healing and keep it. Order your copy from the Amazon Kindle Store or visit our online shop at www.hubertangel.org or call the number on the screen now. Hubert Angel Ministerial Association For mentorship, teaching and impartation for those in ministry or those who have a calling, Register at www.uama.co.
For the Good News Church, call the number on the screen for more information. Thank you, our partners and friends, for making it possible to bring this message to you. Those wishing to partner with Hubert Angel, please visit www.hubertangel.org. Now we're going to Prophet Angel's son, Pastor Titus Young, whom he imparted on. Watch as he ministers the prophetic and healing. I want us to pray. I want us to pray for this, for this lady. Were it not for the anointing upon my father, Prophet Hubert Angel, I wouldn't be able to do what we're doing today. But we want to pray for this lady because as I began to walk up the stairs, mom, I, I began to see her faith was growing and growing and growing. And God began to show me that uh, there are certain issues with her health. And God be I, I began to see angels touching her around here. What's, what, what's happening? What, what's, what's the health issues? She has kidney disease. She has kidney disease. But I began to see an angel of the Lord just beginning to minister healing. And I began to see the angel touching and touching. And I prophesy to you right now. God is touching you right now as we are speaking. And I began to say, but God, how else can I know that it is her? And I was, I began to see, I began to see like 19... 50, 1940, 1947, 48, 49. Somewhere there. 1947, 48, 49. When was she born? When was she born? 1949. 1949. Can I prophesy? prophesy. Son of nature. Kalarabosaji. I began to see in the realm of the spirit because she is not from the United Kingdom. She is not from, 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 from UK. But I began to see that there was a time that she used to... Uh, I don't know whether you are hearing me. Uh, what's her background? What's her background? What do you mean? I began to see her praying like this before. Yeah, oh, she's Catholic. She was she Catholic. Was Catholic. Yeah, Son of Major do it! Prophesy! But by you coming here today, being in the same anointing of my father. Let us stretch our hands. We're going to pray for healing right now. Ah, la pradoseha. Even healing to the legs. Even healing to the legs. Even healing to the legs. Healing to the legs. Jesus. Kabradosa dehe. Come on, somebody begin to pray, begin to pray, begin to pray, begin to pray, begin to pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, touch her, touch her, touch her now. Touch her now. Jesus, 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 healing now, healing now, healing now, healing now, healing now. Come on, somebody pray, come on, somebody pray, come on, somebody pray. Healing to your body now. Fire the Holy Ghost, fire the Holy Ghost, fire the Holy Ghost. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. Hallelujah. Walk with me, walk with me, walk with me. Yes, Walk look at me. this. Walk with me. Yes. Oh, come on, somebody celebrate yes. Jesus. Come on, run, 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 mama. Run, 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 run. Look at this. Woo. She could yes. not do this before. But yes. because of the anointing upon my father's yes. life, healing has taken place. Take look place. at her, look at her, look at her, look at her. Look at her, look at her. Celebrate Jesus, somebody. Before. Listen to this. She never done do this before. She could never run like this before. She could never run like this before. No, never. What do you think of this God? Oh, it's amazing. It's He's amazing. Yeah. He's amazing. Celebrate Jesus, somebody. Let's continuously be in the mood of prayer and worship. Hubert Angel Ministerial Association.
for mentorship, teaching, and impartation for those in ministry or those who have a calling. Register at www.uama.co. For the Good News Church, call the number on the screen for more information. Thank you, our partners and friends, for making it possible to bring this message to you. Those wishing to partner with Hubert Angel, please visit www.hubertangel.org.